Woohoo! What up, it's Shankster94, and welcome back to my full play of Resident Evil Outbreak. So in this episode, we are going to play through the Decisions Decisions scenario for a fourth time. And in this playthrough, we are going to play as one of the two canonical characters of this scenario, George Hamilton. Uh, the other canonical character is Yoko Suzuki for that extra cutscene that plays out with her and Greg. And obviously, she was a student here at the university. But I personally think George is the more central canonical character, considering that it's mandatory for you to see his cutscene every time you play through this scenario, while Yoko's is optional, depending on if she's part of your team or not. So I personally think George here is the main canonical character of this scenario. So we will be playing this playthrough as him. Mm -hmm. So here's the thing. I actually already recorded a playthrough with George and I had the same issue that I did when I came back to fully playing this game, starting with the 4Ks. I accidentally had the wrong audio output. So I recorded an entire playthrough without the audio and you can believe I was livid. So I have to do it again, and having some knowledge now of playing through as George in normal mode, I'm gonna know exactly what to do. So this is gonna be just like the last two playthroughs and be somewhat speedy. I almost guarantee it's gonna be faster than the last playthrough, even though Kevin is faster than George inherently. We'll see. Just so you guys know, so I'm kind of gonna blaze through this and focus totally on objective, even though it's the canonical run. I will let the cutscenes play out, however, so that'll lengthen it a little bit. All right, guys, here we go. Too much growth weakens an organization. What should be important becomes overshadowed by greed. Mass production? Ridiculous! One masterpiece is enough. Now let's watch more relevant cutscene since we're playing as George. This place too. It's crazy. That's the shelter from Resident Evil 2. That's the uh, parking garage. Dear George, I have vital information about the current city crisis, which only you will understand. I'm waiting at the university. Please contact me as soon as possible. Peter Jenkins. This is... Raccoon University. Why there? How the hell did that letter make it there? And how did Peter know that George would be there? Alright, since we're playing as George... There's only three people showing up here. And check it out, it's Kevin and Cindy, two AIs we haven't seen spawn yet. So this scenario spawns a lot of different AIs depending on who you're playing as. And I know exactly why. It's because there are special endings you could trigger if you complete the scenario with one of the specific characters alive and you don't have the Daylight Serum. What? All right. Hi! What's wrong? I agree. I just had a thought. Now let's get through some ad libs. Yes, yes. No. Damn it. Ooh, alumnus. All right. Wow. I agree. Huh? Huh? Hello there. Hi. Oh my God. Dear God. So since we're playing as George, I will be making use of his medical set a bit throughout this playthrough. So I'm gonna go this way. Because I want to grab the spectacles straight off. 
<laughs> and can't forget George has that awesome tackle that'll knock a zombie down, so that will come in handy. Isn't there? Come on! What? Sounds like Kevin will follow me for a little while. All right. How dare you? All right, antivirus right there. What? All right. He only saved two bullets. He would have. Kevin's stupid with his 45 when it's controlled by AI. He'll knock off four whole shots before he stops. Did you find something? But I got Isn't lucky there right there because I already use? knocked the zombie down. All right, I'm gonna grab this handgun and oh Kevin, give me those handgun bullets because you sure as fuck here. don't need them. All right. I just had a thought. Huh? Huh? All right. Blue herbs will make more use with George because we can make the pill. Holy shit! Huh. All right, still in normal mode, so the code is 1005. It's over. Did you find? Well, here, here's what I'm thinking. Did you find it? Isn't there any? Did you find something? Give me a break. Okay, already running out of space fast, so. Kevin. I'll give you a pill, because Cindy already has a first aid spray. Thanks. Possibly. Uh, nothing in particular. This must be it. Huh. Did you find nice. it? Nice. Isn't there anything we can? What? Dear God. Uh. What's wrong? Well, here. Hey there. I'm not sure what to do. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and put the jewel in to free up a slot. Find it? Huh. I think so. This will be of help. Looks well, like Kevin was trying to make conversation with George for a second there. Something? I will admit, in the failed recording with the hey. audio, George was able to reply back to that comment Kevin just made. Use those, so give me Perhaps that. You'll allow me here. And take the pills. <laughs> Dear God, here. Good. All right, grab this gun, Cindy. Did you find it? Yeah, before Did Kevin you find does. It? Did you find anything? That was interesting. Thank you. Possibly. Oh my god. Huh? Alright, doesn't matter which one I pull at this point. Did you find it? I just had a thought. What? I'm not sure what to do. Did you find anything? Huh? Did you find anything? Huh? Isn't there? Did you find it? 
Dear God. Did you find anything? <laughs> it's too bad I'm not playing as Cindy. Otherwise, we could play this piano and trigger the jewel that way. That's a special event that only Cindy can do it's that I plan over. on doing when I play as her. Dear God. Ooh, that was close. To make. Did you find something? <laughs> Damn. Isn't there anything we can right, use? Use these straight off. Is there nothing useful? Well, huh. Did you find anything? Oh my god! <laughs> and going this way, no. I could see what the elevator code is and Any save progress? some time. Did you find it? I'm actually going to give some of these to Cindy. Thank you. Yes. Did you find something? Here. Seems Cindy will follow George what? wherever he goes, but still wander. Huh? I think George and Cindy are actually kind of close in this game, I want to say. Alright, I'm gonna take a blue, but not that green. I'll let Kevin take it, if anything. He has two green herbs, that's good. Alright. Did you find it? Come on! Uh-huh. What? Oh. Alright, uh -huh. the other Julene. What shall I do? What shall I do? I'm not sure what to do. <laughs> Stop. Huh? Alright, George is about to have a really bad day. He had a shocking look. <laughs> What's wrong? What's that? I just had a thought. Oh. What? Damn it. Mm. Huh? What? Hey! I just had a thought. Hey! Let's hurry. What's that? I'm not sure what to do. Hi! I understand. I have this feeling. Perhaps you'll allow me to have it. Here! I'll take all the small ones. <laughs> Gonna have one large one. All right, and a nine tap virus. All right, let's get going. Hello there. Hi. Hey there. Oh. Excuse me. Hey you. Hey there. Hey there. All right, and I will be taking the V poison route. Did you find something? Dear God. <laughs> no. Hey there. It's more straightforward. Not a lot of backtracking. Actually, there's no backtrack into the V poison route, but there's a little bit of it in the P base route. All right, so it's four it? zero three two. Nice. Did you find anything? Ha! Did you find it? Here? Did you find it? I just had a. Uh huh. What? Huh? <laughs> what now? Let's go. What? Did you find something? I found some information. Here. Hey. Ooh. Perhaps you'll allow me. This is it. Take this. And with this, I can make more large recovery pills. Did you find anything? 
<laughs> Making all these medicines. All right, Cindy, why don't you have a large pill? Thanks. Plus, did you find it? I found some information. May need blue herbs and antidotes down here, considering it's a little tougher. So I'm gonna take this antidote just in case. That's good. All right, learning from Kevin's playthrough, we know there's a spider right down here. So. Oh. Take that. God damn it! Hold your horses. Dear God! <laughs> hey! Damn you! Damn it! How dare you! Burn in hell! Huh? What? Scurry Dear by. God. What's wrong? What shall I do? You help! <laughs> How dare you? Huh? What? Hey there! I just had a thought. I have here. Let's hurry. What shall I do? Hmm. Ooh, my virus is going again. So what I'm gonna do is. Ooh. Blue one over here. <laughs> Just making medicines. And this herb can create a regular antivirus. There you go. I just had a thought. I found it. Hey there. She got herself an assault rifle. And that's fine. Ooh, there's another SP item. Okay, now that I know that. She switched it for the pesticide spray. That is smart, Cindy. Very smart. Pesticide spray is not going to do shit here. Because you have to let those wasps get close to you for that to be any use. Come on, Cindy. Here. What's wrong? Oh, she'll follow me anyway, so who cares? I'm not sure what to do. All right, we'll go through the subway again. Yeah. What's wrong? What shall I do? I got a critical in there. I heard it. Help! Brace yourself! Help! Brace yourself! Help! Running out of ammo fast. Don't you dare, Cindy. You already have one. Huh? Well, there's something. Watch out! Overkill? Jesus fucking Christ! I'm running Help! out of ammo. All right, goodbye, handgun. Dear God. Okay, a red herb. Hmm, I don't have any herbs to go with it. Damn. <laughs> All right, I'll get rid of the antidote. There's plenty of herbs laying around. I just had a. Hey, what? Dear God. Hello. What shall I do? That was lucky. Hey! What? No. What's wrong? Uh huh. <laughs> what shall I do? I'm not sure what to oh, do. Oh, man. Just had a That's thought. interesting. They put a wasp back here. Dear God! Come on! No! Hey! Excuse me! Why won't she follow me? Hey you! <laughs> there she goes. Hey there! Hey there! Hey. Alright, and this is perfect, cause now with this herb, Hello there. the RGB make an antivirus long. And I could use that right now. I just had a thought. 
dear God. <laughs> that was funny. They said the same phrase. This is about. Oh. Well, that's easy. <laughs> Did you find it? Huh? It's over. What? Oh. Hold your horses. You seem agitated. Hello there. Huh? All right, Cindy, have this <laughs> partial clip. Wow. Okay. Handgun rounds. I just had a thought. Dear God. Did you find anything? And that's a simple lock. All right. I'm not going in that other room. I don't see a point, really. They're not. St don't give up. What? Come on. What's wrong? What's that? Did you find some? I found some information. I'm not sure what to do. What's happening? All right, I gotta move quick here. What? Almost made it through without something, but Cindy got fucking poked. And she's poisoned, go figure. Man, there's more wasps out here, holy shit. So yeah, normal mode really changes this part up. Yep, you're poisoned, find a blue herb. Whoa! Alright, Cindy, you don't want to follow me now. You're gonna fucking die now. I'm poisoned. I think there's an antidote in this room. Huh? Huh? What? Oh. I found You don't need three first aid sprays. Come here. Here. I don't know. Wow, she's not coming with me right now. And that really sucks, because... Please pick that up. You're an idiot! Did you find it? Thank you so much. I am... Ooh, Did you find anything? Ooh, I'm gonna kill her. Well, perhaps she'll allow me... She's this being... Is it. She's a blonde. She's retarded. She's worse than Yoko. Thank you. Fuck. I'm not giving you this back because you seem to be just blinded by first aid sprays. It's over. Please help! No. Hi! Target is closing in! Alright, come on. The thing's too huge. These 9mm are useless. Almost got him. Hold on! 
calm down. You must give me your blood. Hey, something's wrong. Sir, let's regain our distance then. Unbelievably, I even yelled for help and she was like, never. What's her beef with George right now? What? Alright, now she has all the pills. I'll, I'll take the one good one. I haven't really got injured yet, so I haven't needed really health. I really don't need to carry health around me, obviously. <laughs> the way the playthroughs have been. Then again, this will be the last one in normal mode, and it'll be up to hard mode after this playthrough, so maybe I will need health from here on out. But that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of that. Mm. Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of the pill for the grenade rounds, because I will switch the grenade launcher eventually. Alright, I'm gonna go use this real quick and then grab the clip, because I'll probably still use it. Actually, 29 bullets left? No. Actually, oh instead, what I'll do is I'll take the pills back and leave the clip. <laughs> huh? What? Oh. What's wrong? I'm not sure Stop what... complaining. Hi! What's wrong? I just had a thought. Hey, you! It's... Hey there! I'm a... Huh? What? Oh. Kevin. Cindy. Possibly. No? Here. Hey! Mmm, come on. What? Hey there. Fuck off. Hey there. There you go. All right, Cindy. Carry one of these, would you? What's happening? Huh? What? Oh. Oh. What's wrong? What shall I do? All right, now let's just go to the B2, get the P base from Kevin and call it. I just had a thought. What now? Did you find it? <laughs> oh my gosh. I picked up. Here. Perhaps you'll allow me. This is it. Did you find anything? All right. Got all three ingredients. Did you find something? Well, I did get some information. Is there Damn, I'm not going to trigger that special cutscene. What? I think it was very lucky that I triggered it with Mark there. Ahead. Once you have three, all three What's ingredients, I feel like your partners follow you no matter what you do. Perhaps you'll allow me... Here. Perhaps you'll... Ahead. Here. Did you find it? Did you find something? Well, here, sir. Uh-huh. 
I know. I don't know. Hi! Hi! Why now? No way. Good. I have this feeling. Hey! No problem at all. Hey there! Hey! Did you find it? Well, here. Did you find anything? Let's hurry! Yeah. Let's hurry! Dear. Uh huh. Excuse me? <sighs> what? Holy shit! Hey! Hey, hey! Damn it! Did you find anything? Did you find it? I found it! Did you find something? <laughs> I found it! Did you find it? Well, here's something. Is there nothing useful? I just had a thought. I'm not sure if this is useful. Dear God! Oh, one thing that one of my viewers keeps mentioning in the comments, now that I'm thinking about it, is one way to keep good track of your partners is when you see their inventories on the screen here. It's the order they're listed in, which makes, apparently, partner one and partner two. And they are scripted, I guess, to enact certain events and scenarios. I just so that's how to keep track of them. Me, personally, I don't care to keep track of stuff like that. Hey. It's not important to me. You should grab those 45 auto rounds, Kevin. Hey, you! Did you find any? Hey, there! What? Perhaps. Hey! Here! Kevin, why don't you take an assault rifle? Here's what I'm thinking. You. It, wow, man! Perhaps you'll allow me. Here! And Cindy, you don't have a weapon anymore, so... Perhaps you'll Stop being so obsessed with first it. aid sprays! I know why she is. She's a health freak, considering she has all those herbs and whatnot. Did you find it? Hey there! Did you find something? That's more like it, Kevin. Did you find anything? My apologies for this place being so hectic. I have been monitoring your progress from here. I am grateful for your assistance. Daylight is it. The only resource against the T-Virus. I cannot give it over to Umbrella. They're the ones responsible for the catastrophe which has befallen the city. In retrospect, that entire tea project was a total disaster. Brute force should not be the only criterion for a weapon. It must also be beautiful, unique, and godlike. You will also assist me. You're going to play with my ultimate creation. Farewell. Almost time. Alright. So, Yoko not being here, it skipped that cutscene completely. Using the Ampu shooter. Alright. Not bad. Here's what I I just had a thought. Hello? Hello there! Hi! Uh. What? Oh. 
What's wrong? What's that? I just had a thought. Hey! Hey there! Dear God! Hey you! Hey there! <laughs> hey! Oh my God! Damn it! I just had a thought. What? And there's the incontinuitous door. What shall I do? Damn it. What? Hey! Huh? What's wrong? Dear God! Here's what I'm thinking. Hi! What? <laughs> hey! Anyone! Oh man. Hello there! What is that? Come on! That was his instaco attack. Hey. And I gave him karma for that. Huh. Over there. Oh my god. Let's hurry. Huh? What? Hey. Hey. Oh. I don't understand why Kevin won't use health items for God's sake. He's waiting until he hits danger Let's before hurry. he does. Forced healed Kevin with the first aid spray since you can equip it and heal them yourself if you want to. Oh my God. Still has stuff in it, why not? I just had a here's what I'm thinking. That's the rest of George Ad Libs, so I'll go ahead and skip to the part where the explosion occurs. Explosion! Cindy with a handgun instead of David with an with a grenade launcher. Hey. What is huh? You give me uh. Huh? <laughs> uh. Huh? All right, they're stuck on a single ad lib in this area for some reason. 
So weird, it's like before the fight, they're all attracted to that side of the area, and then during the fight, they all come back here and make it difficult for me to defeat the Thanatos. Huh? Hey, come on, no way. <laughs> hey, you're not following me right now. They're just being scavengers right now. Alright, bring it on. Ooh, okay. I guess I deserve that. Woohoo! <laughs> that pissed it off. Ooh, I got that straight to the face. Wow, George runs pretty fast. Let's see, George's ending might be important because he's the canonical character. It's finished. I can finally rest. No, I have one thing left to do. Savior. It's just my duty. Like these cutscenes, the characters look more realistic than any other cutscene in the game. Alright, 
I will skip the credits, but I will let this cutscene play out now that the brightness is down and you can see it. You noticed he looked at the camera right there. Breaking the fourth wall. today's results. It's been six months, but the number's still the same. There's no way people could sustain life there. Not humans, no. Sir, there's a call for you from the head office. Put it through. We'll start at noon, as scheduled. Is everything ready? Yes. We'll be dropping two for each, beginning with sample T4. The rest will follow at 15 minute intervals. See this part, <laughs> there's a little turbo blast or something right there and split the jet line. 68%, the consequence of taking the V poison route, still not that bad. But yeah, check out my time, <laughs> just 37 minutes. In the failed recording, it was about 43 minutes, so I was a little faster than I was in that. All right, all three survivors, and I got two SP items, so that's nice. 3,894 points, not bad. I'm gonna go ahead and save. All right, so that was my fourth playthrough, technically my fifth, <laughs> of Decisions Decisions. So I hope you guys enjoyed. That was the canonical run. And that will conclude both easy and normal mode for the rest of this full play. The next playthrough, I will be going back to the beginning, the outbreak scenario, and starting hard mode. And I will be playing each scenario twice with two different characters in hard mode. Until we get to Decisions Decisions again, because the requirement to unlock very hard mode is to beat Decisions Decisions in hard mode. So, we'll just be two playthroughs per scenario in this future run. So, look forward to all of that. The character I have slated to do the first playthrough of Outbreak in hard mode happens to be Kevin. My favorite character, and the fastest. And he's one of the strongest, too, so that's good, because upping the difficulty a notch, I'm going to need some powerful characters. So, shouldn't be too hard of a start. So, look forward to that, guys. This is Shankster94, a.k.a. The Gamer Shankster. Rate, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter, at Shankster underscore 94. Check out my Facebook page. Support me on Patreon. Shout out to Wyatt, also known as the one and only W, for being my one and only active patron. And shout out to all of these individuals who were former patrons. Because one thing I'm going to start doing from this video on is I'm going to shout out anyone who ever was a patron. That is the reward for doing the $1 tier. Just the starting patron, you'll get a shout out from me at the end of every video, whether or not you maintain it. So shout out to all those people. All right, guys, peace out. Hope you enjoyed the playthrough. Look forward to the start of hard mode in Resident Evil Outbreak.